Okay, welcome back to Swanky TV. Uh, today we're going to be focusing on summer styles, so inspiration from like Coachella and you know Leeds Festival, Redden Festival, Glastonbury, all those types of things. We're going to do three different looks today and we're going to introduce the products that I'm going to use throughout the looks when I come to use them. So without any further ado, let's crack on and get started on look one. Already you can see we've got loads of texture coming through there which I just absolutely love. The way I have wandered the hair today is taking nice nice fine sections throughout the head and wandering it away from the head, the, the face, okay? The product I have used to assist me to help hold this in a little bit better is the Mist Malleable here, okay? So this is a nice light mist hairspray. It works really, really well with you being able to touch the hair once it's styled, it doesn't set hard, it just sits in really, really nice, but gives that hair that extra hold so that the style lasts a little bit longer for you. Okay, so I've prepped Steph's hair today with Beach Wave Mousse Spray, which is in the Moroccan oil range, okay. So this gives a really, really nice texture to the hair, giving us a good base, a good structure to work with to really make this style last. We're gonna start by doing two little twists on the top of the hair. What we're gonna do slightly differently though is we're gonna give the section a little bit of a zigzag parting. So basically what that does is give us sort of that waterfall braid effect, which I think can work really, really well. Uh, it's a lot easier to do than the actual waterfall braid. Um, so for yourself at home, it just makes it, as I say, so much easier. We're gonna use the top of the eyebrow as our guide, and we are gonna just take Nice zigzag sections. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a clip and we're gonna just keep that section on the underneath out the way. We're then gonna take a nice neat section at the front of our section on the top and we are just going to start to twist and then we are going to bring hair from the underneath and we are just going to twist that in like so. Off. And what I'd like to do is just push it back a little bit, just so it gives it a little bit more volume. Pull it out a little bit. And then we are going to secure this with a pin. Okay, so that's the one side done. We are now going to move round to the other side and do the exact same. Okay, so we're finding our guide, which is the top of the eyebrow, making sure our bangs are out of the way. Putting that bottom section out of the way. Taking our first section from the front. And again, just twisting. So, you could just come this far and leave it at that. But what we're going to do, just to 
swanky it up a little bit more is create just a little something something through the centre part where the two twists meet here. What I'm going to use now, just to dress this out for a little bit more texture, we are going to go in with our salt dog spray, which is our salt spray. And the way I'm going to apply this, don't want to spray it too close to the head, because what that will do is the product will wet the hair down then and disrupt the style. So what we're going to do is we're going to spray from a distance and just let that mist land nice and lightly on the hair. And that is look one.